Welcome back to the heist at Hilbert's High-Rise Hotel. Oh, oh. Lots of races. Um, we are here at the painting of the Muse of the Four Seasons on a snowy winter's night. We have the spectacles of extra-dimensional experience. We should go in. Oh, here we are back at the uh, hotel, but now it is a snowy winter's night. Ah, oh, interesting. I wonder how much the hotel is now accessible to us in this, well, not the main area. We have a code wheel that we need. So, four codes that we need to enter. Oh. Oh. I was going to say, we have a code wheel. We need to find four codes somewhere, right? That uh, To find out how to get in to Cantor's place. Yeah, we can't get into any of this. Um, and then thought, but like, why would the codes matter? Like, what was the astronomer observing? You know, he'd be looking up at the stars and, yes, he would be looking up at the stars. Winter is a downward pointing triangle. Let's just do down try. I'll do it. Funny. I can almost, I mean, I guess we can't quite see to the high rose part. It's not foggy. Um, we can't open any of these doors, so I think that's as much as we go, we're going to get from here. I do vaguely wonder if um, some of those other decahedral pieces of you know, platonic solid, solid gems might be here, but probably not. Well, I think that's enough for this painting. What was next? Summer. What's spring? That's autumn. So this one is summer. Is it not? I think so. Let's double check. Uh, that's not keys. You fool. No, that's autumn. So then... Summer is... This one. Yes, summer. We have, we go up the steps, the muse of the four seasons on a quiet summer's night. Let us enter. All right, here we are in summer. We can uh, read this again if we want to, but it's uh, not telling us anything we didn't already know. So we can come here and pretend to be a great astronomer. Look out and see Pentagon. I don't think it matters that it's uh, downward pointing. I think that's just the direction I happen to be looking. Very strange for the stars to form up in such patterns, isn't it? Wouldn't you say? Wouldn't you say? I think we're done here for summer. So next one was autumn. Yes. Which is uh, the other way. This one was autumn, right? Uh, keys, not spectacles. You can't use spectacles on the door. Yeah, it's autumn sweet. Here we have the muse of the four seasons on a breezy autumn night. Oh, what does. Put on the spectacles and read the signs that say obey, consume. I oh, know, different different spectacles. It is autumn. And the muse is here, and we look up and we see a circle. Can I climb the statue, you know, and uh, then climb up on the roof and then climb up further up? I think not. I think all we have to find here is the statue. 
Like if there had would be anything else in these periods that we would uh, have kind of have got a a note about it. Uh, so that's circle. Right, and finally spring, which is the majors majors had. Well, they hid it, so I haven't seen the, actually seen the spring painting. Right, I didn't look too ridiculously hard for it. There's a spring, yeah, just to check. Yep. Right, so it used it was originally here. Use of the four seasons on a rainy spring's night. So where's the where's the message? Blah 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 blah. Discover all paintings, but it'd be best to hide the one in your suite just in case. Right, so it's here a painting. So they've hit a painting. Aha. They hit it behind the bed. I just didn't look behind the bed. So there, on a rainy autumn night. You know what? It's rainy. I wonder if I could get the wet sponge just by dropping it on the floor or something. Or dropping it in a pool of water. It's definitely rainy. And we have an X and lots and lots of water dripping down everywhere. Where's my sponge? Sponge. Does it make it wet? Probably not. Wait, where did the sponge go? Wait, it just disappeared? What? Well, that's not right. I just accidentally frogged it and it just vanished. Um, that seems like a bug. I'm going to reload. Which is how far back? Oh my god. Really? Do I have a new save? I didn't even make a save before doing that. Alright, so I made a save just before coming to the winter. Alright. Do I have the sponge still? Yeah, I still got the sponge. Alright, so winter, we check this. Okay. It's information we're after, after all, rather than. Um, go away, specs. Winter, summer, fall, vernal, yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, we've been to summer. We've been to fall. It's vernal, we need to do. Just in case it triggers anything, let's just do the others. Uh, that's autumn, this is summer. No, that was, sum that was autumn. This was summer. For some reason, the orange one, I suppose it's yellowish, makes me think um, they're the other way around. Just in case it actually triggers anything in the scripts, let's actually do them. But I don't think it does, I think it's just purely informational. Come on, come on, give me that. Right. I need to lock it again. Summer, spring, which is green. No. Autumn first. Which is red. Right, which we just saw. Put the specs away. Close the door. Go back to spring. And this time, I guess there's probably no connection between the rain and the sponge I have. Like, I need water. I think the sponge is what I need for water. But, um,. If I just frog the sponge, does it just vanish, right? If I just frog it without looking at anything. Yeah, what the hell? That doesn't make any sense. But, I guess I won't do that then. We come in here and we see an X, which I didn't note down. Oh, I didn't, I didn't note, uh, my save didn't contain these, what were they? Triangle. Pentagon. Circle. And X. And I can admire the falling rain again. 
and hope that this music isn't going to get copyright flagged, which it probably will. Whoa! Particle overload, man. That's, um... Feet. That should be a very wet sponge now. <laughs> but it isn't... Uh, I really don't know... understand what the sponge is all about. But it doesn't matter. For now... Where's my specs? Alright. So we have the four symbols we need. So if we go back to... Um, on this way. Some, some other direction I don't want to go. If we go back to the elevator and then to the penthouse. Only the patrolling guards I really need to look out for there. We still have the problem of I don't have any way of getting the water off. The, you know, cleaning the bubbles off after we've used the lime away. Um, but I can try just putting the sponge on the ground using a water arrow, and I've still got two water arrows, so I can I can spend one on that. Of course, I can save in case it doesn't work at all. Um, so I guess the emergency power reset exists, so that if I turn the power off, I can reset the power to the elevators. This doesn't really make a lot of sense to me. That's fine. Which way was it to the actual penthouse proper? Oh, that's the dining area. I think it must be this one. Yeah. And then we need to go up and over. This is a lovely staircase, by the way. In terms of construction, I really like it. And drop down carefully so we don't waste what little health we have left. Alright, so if we jump in here again. We have the combination, but before I use the combination, let's just drop a sponge on the floor. Make a very odd clink. Shoot a water arrow. It's a wet sponge, okay. Alright, that's all I needed to do. I could have maybe dropped it in the pool or something, but that's good enough. Okay, now we have some more things we can read. Arrow of time never ending. Unceasingly does it fly, travelling forth throughout unending eons of forces, months and years, and now to pass us by. Silver gears of time, perpetually do they grind, ratcheting on and on ad infinitum, because for naught can their twisting gestures be confined. Sands of time everlasting, unrelentingly do they fall, moment after moment for millennia they mark the endless tick of time's righteous protocol. Wheels of time, eternal, inexorably do they turn, ne'er a waver in their tempo, when they reach eternity they simply restart their journey. I have no idea what any of that's about. But, uh, oh look, lots of gargoyles. We do. We have awakened the muse, got the nocturnal lights, start at the top with winter, then chronologic order use. Huh. After that, return to her. So, chron then chronologic order. So, this is actually suggesting not the order they were in the poem, but chronologically, which would be winter, spring. Summer, autumn. So, triangle, X, pentagon, circle. Triangle. Let's get away, X. It's weird because I move the my mouse up and the frog highlight goes down. Pentagon, circle. 
Well, we got that right. After that, return to her. All right, we'll return to the muse, shall we? Where's my glasses? I can't see you. I've lost my glasses. There they are. All right, back to the muse, which means going up and over the top again. And again, if I had more rope arrows, I would just leave two here for convenience sake, but I've only got two, and if I want one anywhere else, leaving both of them here would not help. And um, only one of them here wouldn't really help either. So it's off we go, down again, down again, down again. So we can just walk right across. Can I? I can. It is just glass. Okay. Good, good, good. <laughs> Had to save just in case. Kind of makes sense that you can walk straight through, but, uh, you know, wouldn't be surprising if it was actually a, a hole. These rich people construct their places, you know, in strange fashions, after all. What's the way down? Is this the way down? I think this is the way down. No, that's the way to the pool. I got it wrong. And this is the way down? Yes. So this kind of zigzag staircase? No, it's just the round one. Lots of curving staircases in this uh, hotel, and I really don't have a lot of trouble keeping track of which one's which. Hello, Muse. Do you have my wish for me? You were supposed to give me the wish I desired. Oh. Talisman of Autumn, Talisman of Summer, Talisman of Spring, Talisman of Winter. Well, I I guess that will do nicely. Thank you very much. I still have a problem, right? We can do all this, put the talismans in. We still can't get into the temple proper, right? Because we need the... To get the codex. Because we need the uh, Aleph Stone. And the Aleph Stone is locked away in the gallery, and I don't know how to get it. As soon as we take it off the pedestal, the gate shuts. Now, if we could carry crates around, which we can't, we can't pick up a single crate, right, in this mission? So all marked is not profitable. Well, yeah. If we could carry crates around, then yeah, I would take two crates, stack them up, block the entire gate that closes on us from closing, you know, in traditional Imsum kind of fashion, and then do the thing and then be able to get out. Of course it might be that that could be thwarted if they'd allowed us to rob crates but made that so it would break, you know, have massive break, for, breaking force applied to anything blocking, and then it would just smash the crates. And that would be too bad, but at least I would have tried uh, quite a reasonable seeming approach to getting it out. But I don't know how to get it out. We're gonna have to figure that out in a minute. But let's do the Salafans first. Let's go back in. Okay, we've solved puzzle one, this is puzzle two, puzzle three. We're gonna need the Aleph Stone, I'm sure. Arrow of time, never ending. Uh, what are the talismans we've got? We've got flower that kind of looks like an arrow. We've got a sun that looks nothing like an arrow. Uh, snowflake looks nothing like an arrow. And where's the other one? Why are they not in order? Why are they all in funny order? A leaf that looks nothing like an arrow. Or maybe a little bit like an arrow. Where would the leaf go? Silver gears, probably winter, right? Sands of time. Unrelentingly do they fall. That's gotta be that's gotta be autumn. Yeah. Silver gears twisting. That's gotta be winter. And this one is Wheels of Time. It's got to be the sun. And Spring of the Arrow. Right? Oh. Well, let's me take him back, because it doesn't tell me immediately if it's right or not. Hmm. Unceasingly does it fly, if travelling forth throughout unending eons, forces months and years, and now it passes by. That would be the sun. Right, it travels through unceasing eons. It kind of makes throughout unending eons. Yeah, what's this one? Silver gears, 
Perpetually grinding, ratcheting on and on. I mean, it's silver and gear like. Sands of time, unrelentingly do they fall, right? They mark the endless tick of times. Why are you so ambiguous? Wheels of time, how's the. Inexorably do they turn? I don't know. Am I just doing this at random? Does it give me any indication when I've got the right one, or am I supposed to somehow figure it out otherwise? Because spring, summer, winter, where's the, where's the other one? Why do they not sit together? <sighs> ah, pff, pff, I'm a fool. Read the capital letters. It says autumn just down the left. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Spring. Ignore the text. Read, read the uh, capitals. God. <laughs> Spring. All right. Uh, summer. Dear, dear, dear. Yeah. So just trying to find vague connections. However, the wheels. Oh, there's the wheels of time. It says winter. I don't really only need to look at the first letter for a roll of them, except summer and spring, right? Duh. Well, did I feel stupid? Oh, hello. What's coming up out of here? A pedestal. A pedestal for the Aleph Stone. All right. So I need the Aleph Stone now. All right, well then I think I'm done in here for just now. Always just concerns me when I come out looking at that view and I feel like there's a weird perspective and then I move the mouse and it moves wrong and I suddenly all crazy shake my head and I'm back to normal perspective, but yeah. So suddenly like you're looking at it wrong kind of thing. That's very weird. Why is it that pattern above the door? It's actually a, a thing that opens or is it just, just decorative? Just decorative. All right, gallery. We don't get to the gallery from the penthouse, do we? Do we? No, it's not this side. Anyway, it's all library and stuff. Um, I get the feeling the gal the penthouse is one upper wing, and the gallery is the other. Now, there is the whole wishing pool thing, right? Out this side. Maybe I can try smashing this door down. Worth a shot, isn't it? I mean, perhaps I'm not even meant to get here. It feels like, why would you build a space that you can't get to? It's not gonna break. Why would you build a space that you can't get to? It's a wishing pool. I mean, I can see the circular shape. It fulfills the puzzle purpose, but it doesn't fulfill the loot purpose. And the other pool, which is the one with the Oh, the infinity pool. There's a ring lost in it near the waterfall, right? There's got to be a way. Certainly got to be a way to get to that. Uh, remind me, what was down here again? I don't recall. Oh, the gallery. But the wrong part of the gallery. It's the west wing I need. Where the thing is, it's not the gallery. And the west wing... I don't get to from here. Right. The west wing I get to... From... From here. From up here. Okay, I don't need to go up and down left anymore. Actually, did I explore all these rooms? Oh, there's the armory I haven't got into as well, either. Yeah, I went into these. Oh, hello. Just on a whim, I went and looked above a bunk bed and found a whole bunch more loot hiding there. Well, well, well. Always pays to be thorough and searching. 
Look in every nook and cranny. Uh, it's also tedious to do so. Is somebody snoring? Oh. Okay, have I been in there? No. This guard is still here, right? He doesn't have a key or anything. Let's just knock him out so that I can make noise. Can I get out of here? I can, there's a ledge. Can I get anywhere interesting from this or is it just a, another way around? Can I get to there where that sleeping guy is? Not like that. Try again. For some reason I didn't manage to, uh, it wasn't mantling. Why are you not mantling, Garrett? Mantle. Well, maybe that's made of wood. Let's try, let's try a repair. That's not made of wood. Mantle, Garrett. You know the whole run, jump. There we are. Had to jump a little later. Sorry, a little earlier than the edge. Found a secret. Okay, and a healing potion. Oh my God, I'm so happy. Oh, I got this key. Captain's key. Oh. Captain, be quiet. I want to look around your bed for other loot. Jump. Get up there, Garrett. No. Oh, there's just two, yeah, two doors to his room. That's, that's very odd. But okay, we've got the captain's key now. Uh, does that mean that I can get to the captain of the guard's room that was locked before? Does it get to the armory? Yes. Not that I necessarily need to. Flash bomb. Come on, grab the... That's what I wanted. Flash bomb in that. Another flash bomb. Two flash bombs now. Now that it's a little late when I've basically knocked out pretty much all the guards that would be bothering me, but, you know... Better late than never. So then up these stairs is the west wing. Still not sure if I'm supposed to be able to frob that furniture, you know, that was blocking the door. Right, I'm still not sure. Well, it doesn't relock, that's a kind of a bug. Uh, but never mind. If I was supposed to be able to frob the furniture from this side, or whether there's another way into the west wing that I just haven't found. Let's stand on the garret. Now from it. Now get stuck on the door. Good, good. Uh, yeah, so much for that fun. Right, so how do I get this thing? I mean, the spectacles aren't going to let me see it, right? The wet sponge I've dealt with, I've used. The fact that propping it just makes it vanish is a, is a pretty bad bug, but... Um, doesn't matter. Lime away. Flash bomb. I don't really have anything. Uh, before I go in there, I don't really have anything that will let me uh, swap for it. Especially not now that the 8 ball's gone. The 8 ball didn't work before either, so I tried it. So. Uh, how do we get back down from here? Back to the stairs. Where are the stairs? Here. Well, let's go back to the penthouse lift then. If we go back... Now I've got another key. Let's go see if I can get into any other... Wrong way. Any other doors that were previously not available to me. There's the lift.
that's the guest floors. What do I want? I want this. Where was the staff door? The staff area, I think, was where the place I was looking for was. Nope, didn't hold it long enough. Hotel administration. The captain's key isn't going to work here, right? But there was a room up here that I could not enter. We dealt with the security room. We found the safe there. There was a room here that I could not enter. Which is the chief of staff. Oh. Which captain's key doesn't open. The captain's key doesn't even lock his own room, but it doesn't help me. It's like, I thought, what is it there? It's a bench with two bodies lying on it. Um, where does this go? I forget. Oh, this part. Yeah, yeah this vent and things. I am a little bit at a loss now. I have absolutely no idea how to get out of stone. Don't know how to get into the chief of staff or the hotel administration or if they're relevant. Don't know how to get to the pools. Either pool, or if I need to, but I don't know one of them has a should have loot in it. Um, oh, this is also an easy way to get to that area without worrying about propping that button. Okay. So any anything I have, give me more hints. The crumpled poem was the safe code. I don't need it anymore. Can I drop it? Oh, let's drop things in a nice light space. Let's see the letter. The lime away. I've used the lime away. I don't think I need it anymore. I can't drop it. Lime away instruction. Wet sponge? Can't drop the wet sponge. Letter to Brewer. Security protocol. Paintings as a method of egress. Um, transport the stone to its new home. If you need to borrow spectacles, in a safe. Poem. That just tells me about the poem, so I don't need that. Note to Kevil. Rewire the alarm button. Okay, so it's telling me it's not wired up. Deactivate the automatic door button because of, yeah, it told me how to get through. Clean up the mess in the Alastone exhibit. Well, I guess I've got a wet sponge. I could try cleaning up the mess. <laughs> Board up all access points. Okay, I don't think that needs to be done. But the upper west wing is where the stone was, right? And that's why the furniture was in the way. Including the atrium windows. I guess the... So I didn't get in there through the atrium windows, but I guess the atrium windows is how I'm supposed to get in there. Maybe I should go back to the west wing and try to get through the atrium windows to see where that takes me. Maybe maybe it won't take me anywhere, but maybe it'll take me via a place I maybe can't access yet in you know, some kind of reverse pathfinding. Um, the penthouse access code is dealt with. So I'll go back to the west wing and try the windows. I'll keep that one for now. Spectacles manu manual. Yeah, it doesn't really tell me anything I didn't already know. Let's drop that here as well. Let's keep this line away instructions I don't need. All right. I can't drop the line away, but that's fine. That's, uh, that's simplified my inventory a little. Back to the west wing, which means back to the penthouse, which is this one. And then this way. So atrium windows, right? Is this the atrium? Ah, uh, okay. No, it's not going to get me anywhere new, but now I see how I could have got to the west wing without throbbing the furniture through the door. Or not. <laughs> uh, okay, no, that's less successful. Um, hmm. The rope's not long enough. If the rope had been long enough, then that would have been a good way in, you know, to climb up there. But as it is... That's just a red herring. I mean, I can 
try getting on top of the beam from here and see if there's uh, anything of interest there. So we got thank you. It doesn't reach anywhere near far enough to uh, get up here originally, but I can climb up here. For all the good it will do me. Guess there's nothing up here. Can I get down from here safely? Well, that's the real trick, isn't it? I can. Nice. Um, unless by atrium windows they meant this atrium. Do any of these windows open? Probably worth just checking. I'm really not sure how I'm supposed to kind of get in. Yeah. I don't know how I'm supposed to get out of here, but like, okay, so if one of those windows opened, it would be an easy way out, right? I mean, easy peasy to go out the window with the with the Elf Stone. So on that note, actually, to check, none of the other banners are being cut off, but maybe one of these is just concealing something. Okay, nope. That's consistent, then none of them are cuttable. What about the roof? Is there any way out by the roof? Any kind of vents or anything? Anything I'll be missing? I don't think so. Check the walls. Hmm, nothing obvious. I feel like I need something that would be the same weight as the Alice Stone. Right? so far so this part was boarded off and this side was boarded off so the rest of it was accessible all this part was otherwise accessible right yeah it's just this the stairway where's this go again I've forgotten oh, there's a body I dropped over oh, this is just This is just the dining area, right? With the vent there. Yeah. yeah. This is just above the dining area and entirely inconsequential, really. It's like fancy and all, but it doesn't really go anywhere or do anything or mean anything. It's just an archer overlooking, well, overlooking tons of gold, but probably wouldn't even see anyone from here because it's kind of hard to see anything from up here. Incidentally, this is a nice thick uh, balustrade, which is kind of what they all should be for man for better mantling, but you know. People like to put thin ones in because they look good, and then mantling is a fraught business of mantle up. If you want to drop sound quietly off, you got to mantle up, then you're half off the edge, you got to step back a tiny bit, then you got to crouch. Ugh. If it's wide enough to mantle, you just mantle. How do I get this thing? How do I get this thing? Let's just do another dry run, right? Remember not to look at it. Except very quickly. I wonder if I could get there fast enough. Let's go. No, I can't get there fast enough. That makes lock sounds because it's functionally a lock and the Alice Stone is functionally a key, but that's just implementation detail. It should have been changed so it didn't make lock sounds because it's not it's not meant to be working as a lock. It's just meant to be working as you put the thing on there. Oh! Oh! How does this close, right? Tell me how this closes. Power. Power. We need to turn the power off, right? Where's the power reset switch? So it's by the left. How do we get there quickly? It's not from here, is it?
Yeah, this is the wrong side. Well, I don't know about, I don't know quickly, man. Makes any difference. Was there a panel reset up here somewhere? I don't recall. Um, the power to lift was in the basement. I can't get to the basement from this section of the place. I can get down to the penthouse lift and the power reset there, right? I don't think this is going to work, but I should try it. So it's the power reset button by the lift. Emergency power reset. Feels like it's a reset, right? Not a turn off. That's why I don't think it's gonna work. If it came up here, and we go back here, try this thing again that power reset is not going to stop this from closing right if we had the power off maybe it would yeah so if we had the power off why was he why was he saying including the atrium windows right he didn't board off the atrium windows quite clearly um and how did he get out after doing his boarding off i don't know but the atrium windows thing seems to have been a hint that doesn't hint a non oh no 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 so you, i can get to this part i could get to this part anyway and getting to this part i can use ropes get up on the beams get across right that's the way i'm supposed to get in through those atrium windows over there right that's cleared that up in my head back to my previous train of thought getting the lf stone This does not get us, we can't get to ground level, right? This is, this is the thing, and then this is the library. And I don't think there's anything in the library to help me. Was there anything in the library at all? I mean, it's, it's a very nice looking library. Um, very, very well made, very nicely constructed. Looks lovely. Was there anything at all in here that was relevant to anything? That's just the stairs up and down. I guess there was some loot on that table. That was it. And some loots in the corner. Yeah, because we hit our loot goal while we're in here. But I'm not going to scour these shelves again, not unless I have a good reason to believe I would find something. Did I scour these ones? I'll scour these middle ones, because I'm not sure I did. I'm sure I, I probably did, but I'm not sure. Yeah, there's nothing. There's nothing at all. And did I check under the stairs? You know. Checking beside a bed happens, you know, yielded fruit unexpectedly, but not that. Too many places I can't get into, and too many reasons that I don't know why. And probably one of them has the hint I need. How do I get into the administration? How do I get into the... It wasn't the captain's, it was the chief of staff. Um... I don't know. How do we get the Aleph stone? I don't feel like I've got any clues that lead me to any of this. It's like, maybe there's a clue to the Aleph stone in one of those two locked rooms. Or by the pool, or by the other pool. But then... To get to those... Surely I need... Keys that are not forthcoming. All right, yeah, this already all connects, of course. This is all the penthouse. So the only keys that are not forthcoming. Let's go back to this guy's office, which is a straight ahead one, I think. To Hilbert's personal office, right? Oh, no, oh yeah, yeah, this will do. This, I could go the other way and not have to do the rope arrow malarkey again, but... That's fine, I can do the repower malarkey. I've done it many times before. Wait, I have three repowers now? Ah, <laughs> oh, there must have been one in the army. Alright, well I can leave one here then for convenience to sake and just keep one. Good. That's one slight 
uh, benefit, though very slight now, because I feel like I'm actually done with this section. But I'll do it anyway. Alright, did I miss a key? Somewhere in this big room. Like, randomly lying on the floor? Of course not. Of course there's not a key randomly lying on the floor or in the wastebasket. Or on the desk, invisible, or in that loop thing which I already opened. Or on the windowsill. Why would there be? Right? Why would there be? I think that's just a red herring. The highlighted numbers there, they're not related to any puzzle I've possibly seen. I feel like it's items I'm missing. <sighs> items are not um, puzzle combinations. Codes. That's the word I was looking for. So, what now? I can't get in here. No, not you. Oh, this one's not even a door. So I guess I can never get there. So that's one I can forget about. But still, that's three doors. There's the infinity pond, infinity pool. There's... The... Hotel administration. And what are these all about? Feels like it's got to relate. Why can't I turn the elevator power off? Makes no sense. There's got to be a reason for it. Is there a trapdoor? Let's save. Is there a trapdoor on the top of the elevator? You know, an escape hatch. No, but worth checking. And interestingly, that's stuck. So I get the feeling this elevator merely teleports me rather than uh, moves. I feel like it's a fake elevator. Uh, there's got to be a way in here. It's closed until the hotel returns to full operations, right? In invisible but deadly barriers are erected around the sides of the pool. So you shouldn't fall in. I mean, it's not actually infinitely deep. There is a lever there. Look, there's a giant lever for this gate. There's a door. How do I get there? Where are those windows? So those are the win that overlook this. Can I get to those windows? I don't think this is answering any actual real questions. I think I'm just grasping at straws. But I'll grasp at straws for uh, just a little bit longer before I go hit the forums. As I said, because this is a puzzle mission, you know. Um, it feels like it's important to give the puzzles a chance, as you might say. So this this section here overlooking the infinity pool. That is overlooking can't really tell. There's a big fence. Wait, I can get up there. I can I mean I can get out. Let's go to the upper floor where I can actually get out on the balcony and look down, right? And see what I'm looking over. Maybe I can just drop down. Maybe I can just jump in. What does this overlook? Uh, no, this overlooks the statue, not the infinity pool. That would be the infinity pool over there, or is that the entrance? That's the entrance. The infinity pool would be on the western side here. So the whole thing, if I could reach those roofs... Well, I kind of can, can't I? This one's got a telescope in the way, but this one would let me climb on the roof. I feel like this is not what I should be doing. I feel like I'm just going to slide my death off this roof. Right? But it also feels worth a try. Or I'm not even going to make it. It might just be too far. See, it feels like it's too far without a strafe jump. And as, you know, as I said before... Oops. And they're running a strafe jump. Strafe jumps never feel like the right uh, solution. They always feel like they're cheating the system. 
So I don't think this is what I should do. I'm going to keep trying it just because I'm out of ideas. Yeah, I just slide. I can stand just on the edge. For all the good that it does me, because I can look down out of the world, get out of bounds in a pointless fashion. But it doesn't help me do anything of importance. Now that's interesting, there's a very dark window there on the floor below. Oddly dark and oddly shaped, like it's actually, like you can actually get out there. That's of interest, even if being out here isn't. I think I feel like I should just reload here. Or fall to my death in the front courtyard, why not? Um, okay, let's go back downstairs. See if we can find that window that looks different. Should be down here. Still grasping at straws, of course. Strawing at grasps. Gasping at stores. Okay, the one that looked different was further along the edge, I guess. Or was it on the... F or was it further below? Let's go around the other side and look through the windows. I can't... Or look out here. The one that looked different... Maybe it was just coincidence that it looked different. No, it was on the floor below. Not on this floor, after all. Not here at all. Uh, so what is on the floor below this? So if I come and look out here... Yeah, I can't, just can't quite see it, but the, the weird looking window is that one. Alright. So that is eastern side, southernmost hallway. Let's keep my compass up. Because it doesn't match up anymore. This floor doesn't, doesn't match, doesn't have the windows. Well, that one might have windows that look out over there. If we keep going to the eastern side, is there a passage that runs... Well, from the office administration, maybe. But... Perhaps that is the answer I'm missing. Perhaps there's a way onto that low roof. And that is what will get me into office administration. Let's go out the front and have a look, shall we? Stand on here. I can get on this low roof. I do not slip off this low roof. This is a suspicious looking window. Finally, progress. And loot. Finally, loot! Loot! Wow, look at look at the goal. Another secret. 8,000. That's the meeting room. Okay, it's not the office administration. Dang it! There was a door that we couldn't open before that I'd just completely forgotten about. So that's just a secret, just some bonus loot. Not progress. Not damn progress. Take that, you flowers. Take my... Uh, you know, venge my anger on you. Venge? Whatever. That's a lovely fancy wallpaper, that is. Alright, so still no progress. In a... of a meaningful sort. Yeah, that was a secret out there too. Okay. I'd completely forgotten that door. So there were four doors I knew of that I couldn't open. Or maybe more that I've forgotten. Who knows? Perhaps more that I've forgotten. Um, well, actually, that raises other interesting possibilities. If I can get on that roof just like that, then I can get on that roof in all the other seasons. And maybe there's more secrets on the roof in those. I doubt it. Probably worth a try, but probably only worth a try after I've kind of got back on track with what I'm supposed to be doing. With finding out... That's just the stairs, isn't it? Yeah. Back on track with finding out how to open any of these doors I can't open. Or get the stone, if that's what I need to do. So, I'm going to hit the forums again, I guess. Yeah. Alright, I'll cut the episode here. 
um, and go look at the forums and then hopefully have an answer for you. So thanks for watching, hope to see you soon in the next episode.